live from New York, it's the Native Edge, everybody! Allow yourself to grow. It's not every day a guy from Browning, Montana gets to come to New York City to get to speak. It's uh, gotten me out of my comfort zone. I'm at a crossroad with my business, and I feel through growth comes partnerships, knowledge, and resources, and that's what brought me here. I love being a part of the energy that the National Center Native Edge Institutes put forth. Definitely a resource for Native entrepreneurs. It's basically laying a path for us to follow. We are here today in New York City's East Village at Relative Arts. We have over 30 different indigenous artists from Canada to the U.S to Central America, South America, Mexico. A lot of the work is traditional practices, but in a contemporary flair. We are really lucky to work on consignment, which is a way for us to be able to get as much product as possible without having upfront costs. So we do a 70-30 split. So 70% goes to the artist and 30% goes back into the store. If there's more artists, the best thing to do is to email us and it's info at relativeartsnyc.com. It has been an honor and a privilege to be here at the Native Edge Institute. Access to capital, as you know, is the number one impediment for all businesses. What we are looking to do is help our clients to secure contracts, capital, and to access market opportunities both domestically and internationally. What brought me to the NEI was the idea of partnerships and investing. So I was able to network with like two or three very amazing people. There's some really great ways to connect with me too. I'm going to be at the next res, which is put on yearly. And if you ever have an opportunity to come to the NEI, take that advantage. I know they have it in virtual, but come in person. To me, it's great to be a part of an event like this because being a restaurateur as well as speaking training, it's about entrepreneurship and really it comes down to service, wanting to help other people. Really opened my eyes to what us in Indian country can do. If I can inspire anybody, somebody who wants to do something that's going to better their life, then that's what's truly fulfilling my heart.